so we get some rain. We had some last night. I went yep. through some puddles this morning, so I know it was there. And we're also getting another wave, but we could have some bad news with it, right? Yeah, it's going to come with a price tag. Severe storms likely with this next round moving in. When you look outside and you notice how clear it is and how warm it is, Jamie, yeah. for this time of year, 71, uh, something's up and something's up with the weather. Things are going to start to turn a little nasty, ugly as we get into the uh, evening hours and overnight hours. I want to show you a picture from this morning, the 2600 block of 6th Street Northeast. Trees down. Get ready for more scenes like that as we head through time. Right now, storm track radar is pretty quiet. Isolated showers lingering around Alex City. But as we take a look at the bigger picture here, I want to point out this big area of low pressure. We've got a big dip in the jet stream. Moisture coming in out of the Gulf of Mexico. We've got a lot of ingredients in place for uh, severe weather, including the possibility of seeing a few tornadoes, gusty storms, with winds uh, dropping maybe 60 mile an hour wind gust out of them and or some small hail. So a lot to talk about and think about as we head through the day today, overnight into tomorrow morning before things finally calm down. So let's walk through the forecast hour by hour with our future cast radar starting the clock at 4 p.m. Notice it's pretty quiet at 4. Then things will start to pop 7 o'clock. Isolated showers. Severe storms possible across northwest central Alabama, right up the Interstate 22 corridor. And then things are going to get real busy early tomorrow morning, 4 o'clock. A line of showers and storms. And keep in mind, there could be a few severe storms out ahead of the line and within this line as it pushes through the metro area. It's going to be a nasty Wednesday morning commute. So heads up, make sure you've got your severe weather plan in place and then that'll move out of here finally and cold air moves in clear and cold air moves in as we head into the weekend so today is a weather alert day i just showed you why into tomorrow the same deal cold front comes on in clean sweep thursday into friday overnight lows back down into the lower 30s jamie